And getting ready to make some ferro rods. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I have to use my finger to count. Big deal. Seven uh, lobster trap oak. These three here are made out of uh, wine barrels. And this is the kind of thing there. It's for making smoking. For smoking or, or barbecue and stuff like that. But they're nice. Almost the perfect size for them. There's long ones and short ones like that. This is a piece of birch, I believe, that's kind of malted or spolt or whatever. And this is a piece of fat wood that I put a little ferro rod into. And when I was drilling, let's see here for a second. I saved the shavings and there, see, real easy to start a fire with uh, fat wood. And I thought this was only marginable and wouldn't be very good for it, but it uh, works well. How the hell do I put this out now? Eh. Anyway, I'll let them sit overnight so the glue can do, uh, do its job. This is the... That doesn't work. <laughs> it's upside down. I use Gorilla Glue, which you put water in. Or you wet both objects that it's going to and it reacts with water. I've been using beer, so it'll be really, really, really strong. Look at this fella here. The glue is coming out of the sides. <laughs> and all these were it came out of the bottom. See, it was stuck right here. Anyway, uh, so much for the hard part. Now I'll just wait till tomorrow. I'll sand them up, put some finger notches in them, and uh, put a lanyard on them. And that will be my Sunday. <laughs> Besides drinking beer and uh, watching football. Yeah. Cheers, Chris. <laughs>